today about how I made um, this big piece, um, which is from my Antarctic trip, um, called Ice Patrol. I went to Antarctica um, as the friends of the Scott Polar Research Institute's Antarctic Artist in Residence in January and February um, 2017. And so quite a big part of my portfolio uh, and the work that I'm showing at the moment is inspired from my reference material, sketches and photographs that I took when I was on board HMS Protector um, during that residency. So this video is just going to show you a little bit about how I made this piece and hope you enjoy it. Ice Patrol is actually a digital collage and the way I make my work is using a mix of traditional and digital techniques. So all of my pieces start with really detailed pencil line work. Um, I also use different watercolour washes, um, textures, things like sandpaper and fake fur and I take all those elements and I scan them into the computer and that's when I start the, the digital part of my work, layering all these hand-rendered -re elements together in a program called Adobe Photoshop. The original drawing for Ice Patrol was 120 centimetres wide by 42 centimetres high. Once that drawing was completed, I had to scan it in, in separate pieces, into Photoshop before I could then begin overlaying the colours, washes and textures which make up finished digital collage piece. This screen recording shows you, layer on layer, all the different layers of colour, wash and texture that I apply to the line drawing to create the finished digital collage. Each one of these elements that's appearing is a different layer in Adobe Photoshop and the finished piece comprised around 100 different layers. This piece took around three weeks to create. I once completed the original artwork exists as a digital file. From this file, I then create limited edition prints. This piece has a limited run of 50 editions. I have my own fine art printer which enables me to create prints up to 24 inches wide and indefinitely long. Being able to print them myself enables me to have full control over the colour, saturation and contrast of the finished prints. This piece was inspired by a particular day spent on HMS Protector in Marguerite Bay on the Antarctic Peninsula. Beautiful blue skies, incredible mountains, and a pod of 19 wild orcas made for a memorable experience. The natural world is a constant inspiration for my work. If you'd like to find out more, then please visit my website. And thank you very much for listening. Thank you.